in this lecture we will learn how to model dynamic systems with Simulink. Simulink is a toolbox in MATLAB uh, for graphically representing dynamic system and simulating dynamic systems. Now in this figure we see that there is a mass M uh, which is connected to a linear damper on the right side and a linear spring on the left uh, side. Um, the first thing we do is draw the free body diagrams uh, and by convention everything that moves to the positive x direction points in the positive x direction is positive and vice versa here you have the mass you have the driving force which is pointing in the positive x direction therefore it's positive the damper resists the motion of the mass therefore it exerts a force fb in the negative x direction therefore it's negative you have the spring force which is again in the negative x direction the spring here is an extension and therefore resists the motion of the mass so fk also is in the negative x direction sum all the forces in the x direction and we get the equation mx double dot equal to f minus kx minus bx dot now we write this equation in a form that gives an explicit expression for x double dot. We'll use this equation to write a graphical representation of the dynamic system which is suitable for input into Simulink. Here you have the equation. Let's look at x double dot. If we integrate it once we get x dot. If we integrate x dot once we get x now we need to get this equation somehow so let's multiply x by k now next we'll multiply x dot by b sum them that's this much here now we subtract the sum from f like so and then we scale the result by 1 divided by m like so that equal to x double dot now this is essentially the representation in simulink you'll find that simulink has blocks for integration you'll have simulink blocks for um, gains you'll have simulink blocks for uh, addition this is the end of this lecture